Anonymous Watch Guy here with an unboxing video. Quick wrist check. We're on the world's greatest field watch today, the Hamilton Khaki Field. Very cool watch. Today we have an unboxing of a very colorful and affordable watch. Um, and you see the case in front of us here. No, it's not French. It's not American. Not sure why there's a rooster on the cover there. But it is Chinese. It is a Merker. Uh, and on the Merker website, uh, it lists this as a mechanical retro dress watch. Um, it does You do get a nice polishing cloth. You've got a huge instruction book. Uh, some warranty paperwork back there. And then we have the watch. I did cheat and open the box, the case here, and take all the plastic off before I started filming. But this is the Merker Rainbow. This is part of their FOD line. Um, and as you can see, if you're familiar with watches um, and dive watches, it has a decompression table on it. And this is clearly not a dive watch, uh, but it's definitely colorful and cool and interesting looking. Uh, and this is a 40 millimeter watch. It is 45 millimeters lug tip to lug tip. You do have a 20 millimeter lug width there. It is approximately 12 millimeters thick. You do have a signed push pull crown at the three o'clock position. Uh, this is a K1 mineral crystal uh, on this bad boy. And this is an in-house movement. This is a marker in-house movement called the MO1D. Uh, and it is a uh, mechanical hand wine movement. Uh, so very interesting. You get an in-house movement for around 120 US dollars is what I paid for this watch. So very, very affordable. You do have a kind of a Bostock style bezel, uh, bi-directional, just kind of pressure fit, no clicks, uh, nothing like that, uh, just pressure fit bezel. Really like that the colors on this, it does kind of look retro uh, with the color choices on that decompression timer and the contrast uh, with the black dial. And it does say decompression cell hand winding on the dial there and FOD. It's got meters and feet up there at the top. Um, but very cool. I like that kind of black and white handset. Uh, the black matching kind of the center disc on the dial there. You get a white seconds hand. You've got kind of a domed. Uh, mineral crystal gives you some nice uh, don't know if there's any uh, AR coating on that bad boy I would doubt it at this price point but some nice distortion on the dial there got a beads of rice a bracelet very thin bracelet uh, high polish on the end of the, of the edges of the bracelet uh, butterfly clasp this bracelet actually doesn't feel too bad for uh, the price point. And on the back, you've got some Chinese writing and just a regular kind of screw on basic case back. Uh, but uh, I did buy this watch from Merker directly from their website. Uh, it arrived from China pretty quickly in about a week or so. And this is, again, around 120 US dollars. Uh, and, you know, Merker describes this as a dress watch. Uh, you know, it, I don't know if I would describe it as a dress watch. I'd call it just kind of a cool everyday watch. It's definitely not a dive watch uh, with its 50 meters water resistance. Um, but, uh, you know, it gives that look with the decompression timer on the dial. Really like the mid case, really thin mid case, high polish, uh, lights curved down. Um, 
nice grip on the bezel. Just a really cool looking watch. Really cool, fun watch. Interesting to look at. Good conversation starter. Uh, and just, you know, an enjoyable piece. Uh, so where are you going to get a watch with an in-house movement for $120? How about that? Uh, but uh, very cool watch. Uh, I will leave a a uh, link to the Merker website in the description of the video. Uh, if you like the video, maybe give me a like or subscribe to the channel. Uh, but there you have it, the Merker Rainbow. Thanks for watching.